Hey, welcome back to the vlog. It is August 18th, and I just got back from a doll sheet hunt up in Alaska. I've been spending the last two and a half, three days editing, just jamming on the computer full time, like 15 hour days. Just going through images and cataloging, organizing, editing, delivering to clients, all the things. But now it's uh, my girlfriend's weekend. I'm headed out to meet her, and we're gonna go chase some antelope with the bow. Archery antelope is one of my favorite hunts. There's just so many opportunities, usually. The other great thing is it's 49 degrees out right now. Two days ago, it was 95. We just got this big giant weather system, came into Montana, and you gotta love it. <laughs> but enough jibber jabber, let's, uh, let's go hunting. How's the, how's the hunt going there, babe? Well, we found the cows. <laughs> sure did. <laughs> <laughs> Not where we're after today, but the search continues. <laughs> You're saying at some point we're gonna hunt moo cows? Maybe. five antelope right off the road here, probably 200 yards. And the key with road hunting, if you see antelope, just keep driving. Don't stop and look at them, just drive along and just pretend like you didn't even see them. And then as soon as you get out of sight, park and then pull over and then go look at them and see if you can make a game plan. So, so that's what we're doing. <laughs> seen them and all of a sudden I look up and they're like skyline at like 50 yards like running at us. <laughs> That'll happen. <laughs> well hey, first stock of the year. That counts as a stock. That counts as a stock. Oh yeah. <laughs> Snack time! <laughs> well it's crazy foggy and shockingly we've actually seen a few antelope and the most exciting thing though we just saw a grizzly bear. It was like 500 yards off the road. We just saw it through the fog and of course ran over to try to get some footage of it and is gone. So, so yeah, saw, saw a grizzly bear animal hunting, but didn't get any footage. So did it really even happen? Well, today has been a bit of a bust on the antelope hunting. Just been pouring rain, fog's been bad, but hopefully tomorrow morning the weather breaks and uh, do some more hunting. I hate to complain about the weather because Montana's been a total drought year this year and makes me pretty happy to see and hear rain. So no complaints there, but, but yeah, tonight we're gonna eat some food, hang out a little. This is like a four course entree, right? What, what's, our, what's our first dish? <laughs> Red pepper and tomato soup. Cheers. Mm, fogging up. Second course of tonight's meal is uh, this is homeboy. This is the bull elk I shot last year. That's pretty good. And good morning. Got an antelope spotted, but first things first, gotta cross this creek. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> so we watched that antelope for the last 20 minutes and he finally ducked into this little draw. And so we're cutting the distance. Can't kill him unless you get close, so we'll see what we can do here. Back to the truck and pretty uh this is this was the gumbo before our recent rainstorm. So now I gotta turn around and see if we can get out of here. <laughs> so much fun on that last one uh, getting wet she wants to do it again so here's that here's round two of going through the puddle <laughs> well, we made it out of there but I bet it rained a half an inch in like 30 minutes that was an absolute downpour and it uh it made kind of our main access road pretty, pretty nuts and gnarly and there's lots of storms around. So so we decided to call it and just get out of there and before we got the truck stuck and head back to town now, do some work and get back to antelope hunting in a week. So but that's a wrap on this vlog. Hope you liked it. And if you did, please hit the like button and subscribe and tell all your friends. Honestly, these vlogs, I love doing them. They're, they're really fun and they're, they're a lot of work and it would mean the world to me to get to get more people subscribed and, and more people watching them. So, so if you got uh, friends or family that you think would enjoy these, please pass this on. I would appreciate that so much. But that's a wrap. So we will see you next time. <laughs>